But the bottom line is, I think you'll have very limited success in trying to educate, say for instance, a serial sexual predator out of their sexuality. So as I was saying, I would uh, lo I'd love to continue to work uh, on, you know, deconstructing Thunderfoot's uh, commentary there or his subsequent video. And whatever. This then bleeds into the weakest claims of rape, which are of the ilk that, sure, I chose of my own volition to get drunk off my face, full in the knowledge that such intoxication in a public place was going to make me more gregarious. And sure, I fully consented at the time. But it's a funny thing because I'm arguing with people in the comments of his latest video and um, they honestly think people haven't heard their, their argument before. They don't understand. It's the whole, people must not understand. No, it's just logic. They, they honestly don't understand that there's a different opinion. So I'm going to describe a, a, some things that explain why men need to be taught what rape is. By the way, that's what the new saying is going to be. Don't tell men. But in the hard light of the morning after the night before, I decided that I wouldn't have done it how to dress if I was sober. Therefore, it was not consensual. Therefore, it was rape. Let me be clear, drunk or not, tell men, you are responsible for your own actions. You cannot simply drive what rape is, what rape drunk, and then when you do something you regret, be free from is. All right. <clears throat> All so what we're going to be talking about is a thing called consent. Responsibility of your actions by later saying, well, yeah, I wouldn't have driven that way when I was sober. Consent. You do something when you're drunk, that's your responsibility. No matter whether you're a... Now just to be in context, I'm having a beer. Guy or a girl. Let's say you're having a beer with a, yo a lovely young... The 80. All right, consent. You see what I did there? Regulars? Okay. Anyway, consent. Ah, related to consent. Someone drugs you or similar. Well, that's a whole different story. But you are flirting. It's related. But is it a straight line like that? No. Curly line like that? responsible for your actions even if you choose to get drunk first this is not doesn't matter we don't know it could be all of those i think not slut shame this is not victim blaming this and over here we have participation is just owning what you chose to do like it or not there is a spectrum here and like it or not your choices in society related to consent? Yes. It's directly related to consent. Modulate your chances of being in these various situations. 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 Participation. Participation is an interesting word, isn't it? Situation. Situation. Let's say I was playing basketball with my friends. Situation. situation and they play from five till seven situation and i played from five till six and then i said hey i've got to go home early there's something i have to do situation so i have to make a video apologizing for rape so they would say my participation if you really want to reduce such problems to, are you saying that women deserve it exists I did participate. To be raped for wearing short skirts. Correct. Then you have simply... Let's have another drink of beer. Maybe it'll make more sense to you. <clears throat> did I participate? Yes. 
but then I left it early. I didn't participate as much, and you can add a great. Here's how that actually works out, boys and girls. You don't need a gradient or different kinds of participation or amounts. Here's how life always works. In life, there's always this arrow. What is that arrow? What could that possibly be if it is always at all moment? That's right. It is time. Time, boys and girls. That arrow. It is time. Time is that arrow. It is in all situations. All situations happen with different moments. Oh, what is it, Salvador Dali, Mr. Uh, artist Man, you say? Oh, the, the, they're blurry. The points that you refer to are blurry. Or they don't exist. All that exists is in, doesn't matter. How you want to split up the timeline is a matter of theory and debate. But there is always the timeline. The time is an illusion, Piero. Maybe you're right. I don't think so. I think you're kind of nutty. But anyway, even if it's an illusion, it is. And it's the sequencing of events. And with participation, let's use sex as an example. You start participating in sex. What does that mean? Kissing? No. But, but, but when she kissed me, I thought we were going to have sex. Okay, we'll, we'll discuss that. Let's say it is oral sex. Oral sex. So here is oral sex. And it's really good. And then here, ooh, penetration, vaginal penetration. Sorry. <clears throat> and now here it keeps going. And we have a triangle here. And then keep going. Until we get to orgasm for one partner. <clears throat> Alright, so oral sex. Regular sex, we'd call. A triangle and an orgasm. Is that rape? <laughs> sort of depends what happens right here. Doesn't it? Because here is where participation began. And here, the person that had an orgasm rolls off and goes to sleep. If, if, if this was someone saying, I don't want to do it anymore, I don't want, I, I want, to, I want you to stop. That is rape. Right? If the woman right here, or man, says, oh, I don't want to go any further, and you go, oh, you fucking tease, and you might be right, and, and that you're entitled to your opinion. But that doesn't make it not rape you're finishing. So men, this is rape, this part. A woman can stop having sex at any moment and so can you. You could just have had a very uh, depressing uh, thought about your, your dead brother that just died the day before. And you don't want to anymore. There is no finishing up. It doesn't work like that. It's like employment contracts. You can make the employment contract and if you stop early the person that you stop could be liable for, I mean you could be liable for damages and, and whatnot. But you can't assault them. Well I'm just finishing up. So that's rape. 
of course we all agree with this I know I'm just saying in the you know for the public in in terms of teaching what rape is I wanted to state the obvious I know every everybody's gonna say even the MRA people I know we know that's right but I just had to state it to put a baseline of obviousness it's like the color white is boring but you need a white piece of paper to draw on right so this is a baseline okay all right here's something else now this this surprised me but um I'm a victim or maybe a more simple analogy I lock my windows for security but to brick them up for complete security would be dumb, as it would just rob me of the Flirting. pleasure of living in this place. Oh, flirting, you poor. Does not equal consent. Sorry. Now think back to the last example and you might think of various reasons why this is so because flirting is prior to sex and since you can revoke consent so to speak you know what consent isn't really the right word these aren't contracts that you're obliged to and in the modern world you can't sell yourself into indentured servitude there's a limit on what you can be held to agree to and if you agree to something akin to that um, you can have punishment but you aren't put in jail it's not a criminal thing and it does not justify violence or abuse or any violation of your rights whatsoever consent and participation mean flirting does not mean you should expect sex but it should mean object Look, it doesn't mean that. Women are teases. We know a lot of women are teases, right? You would, MRA would tend to agree with that, wouldn't you? So that means you know flirting doesn't mean consent to have sex. You're like, oh, but she I uh, deserved to be raped because she flirted with you and teased you? Thought she could get away with it? You know that flirting does not mean consent or intention to have sex. You know women flirt with more than one person and might not sleep with anybody. You know women flirt with a, some people and sleeps with somebody that wasn't even involved or whatever. You know this. So you cannot think that flirting is acceptably taken as inviting sex, including rape you just don't get to do that so don't tell men how to dress tell men what rape is that's an order <laughs>